Think you've had an eventful start to the year? A lot on your mind and a lot on your eye calendar? Well, you're not getting much sympathy from Naomi Osaka. Here it is mid-April, and it seems that Osaka has lived several lives in 2019. She's run through the draw at the 2019 Australian Open, backing up her US Open title, seizing the top ranking in the process, and becoming the first Japanese player ever to be ranked number one. On the other side of the ledger, she's also lost to four players outside the top 20. She has parted with one coach and partnered with another. She's parted with one shoe and apparel brand and partnered with another. She's been embroiled in a $2 million lawsuit filed by a coach who claims that he's entitled to 20% of her earnings. She's also been told by the Japanese government that by her 22nd birthday this October, she must either give up her U.S. citizenship or her Japanese citizenship. All this among the looming 2020 Olympics. They'll be held in Tokyo, where Osaka will be the hometown heroine. Whoever thought that the U.S. Open final match against Serena Williams would barely qualify as drama for Naomi Osaka. When she broke through that day, she knew immediately that her life would change, that demands upon her would grow, that the intensity of the microscope would increase, and that the highs might be higher and the lows might be lower. But she has smiled through it all and maintained her unique charisma. And if you want some empirical evidence for how she's handled all this, consider where Naomi Osaka resides on the WTA rankings. 